owners across the country are being warned about a potential danger lurking in lakes and ponds that could be deadly, blue-green algae. Last week, three dogs in North Carolina died after swimming in a pond with the algae. Here in New England, the cyanobacteria blooms have been found in Plymouth, Newton, Westport, two locations in Barnstable, as well as in Hollis, New Hampshire. Animal rescue workers want everyone to be on high alert. Abby Izzo and Harpo meant the world to their owners, Denise Mintz and Melissa Martin. We did everything together. When we took one, we took three. But after taking their dogs to play at a Wilmington, North Carolina pond, the joy shattered in just minutes. Denise brought the two little dogs upstairs to get their bath next, and um, she started yelling for me that something was wrong with Abby. Um, one of the Westies. The dogs started to have seizures, so they rushed them to the vet. Less than five hours later, all three dogs were dead. The animals were poisoned by something lurking in the water, a microscopic bacteria called blue-green algae. It mostly infests waters when the weather is warm and releases toxins that can cause liver damage, respiratory paralysis, organ failure, among other deadly conditions. There are different types of symptoms. You could see, probably most likely you would see vomiting, uh, maybe redness of the skin, squinty or redness of the eyes. The same algae that killed the dogs in North Carolina has been found in half a dozen bodies of water in New England, including Crystal Lake in Newton. Most of the time you can see it. There are there are toxins that, are, that come from the bacteria that you can't see, and so they're not terribly long-lived in the environment. Uh, but generally, if you see the green scum, I would avoid that water. As for the North Carolina dog owners, they just want to make sure other pet owners are informed. People need to know about this. Like, I mean, like I said, if we had any clue that this was a thing, they would have never come. I had no idea. Mm. So sad. Dogs yeah. and children are said to be the most likely to ingest the toxins while swimming. Symptoms in children, by the way, include skin and eye irritation and asthma-like symptoms. You'll notice some breathing problems. Wow. We have more information about the local areas where the algae has been found. That's on our website, cbsboston.com. But definitely, if you see that sheen, get out of the water.